If you were going to machine a fully customizable motorbike, what tooling would you use? Well, I'm here at A and B to find out why these guys have chose Serratizit. Now, before you tell me all about this incredible looking motorbike, can you tell me about yourself and Serratizit? Yeah, of course. My name is Uwe Schleinkofer. I'm responsible for the R&D and director of R&D for the Serratizit group. And we are dealing with tools, with uh, cemented carbides, with hard materials. And uh, we are presenting that here at the AMB, especially on focus on cutting tools. Now you're presenting quite a lot here at AMB. Oh yeah. But I want to get on to this because this motorbike looks absolutely incredible. It's crazy, so, yeah? Can you tell me the story behind this? Yeah, it's a kind of collaboration. It's a small company in Spain. It's called Espe. And they are producing customer-made motorbikes. And the specialty of that is it's machined, all the structural components are machined out of solid aluminum. And these uh, aluminum parts are specific designed for strength issues and so on. And every bike is different, so it's customer made for each different customer, it's different. And uh, they are using Ceratisi tools to machine these components with a high material removal rate, basically. So machining everything out of solid blocks must give them their own problems because they've got to get rid of a lot of material very, very quickly to make these bikes cost effective. Excellent. So what tools are they using from you to make it? Because if you just look at the finish on these, it looks amazing. I can't get over how good this bike looks. So what tools are they using to get these sorts of finishes? I mean, it's a, a mixture of different approaches. You need a high material removal rate to be quick. You have to remove a lot of material to uh, reduce weight, of course. You have pockets and these things. But additionally to milling, uh, drilling holes, putting threads on that, you need a nice surface quality to make it look nice, of course. So the finishing of the parts are as well important to machine them the way it looks like you see it here. It's a very unique look. And with our tools, you can machine them that way that it looks that way. Because I just want to we'll get some shots of this, but some of these parts haven't even been polished. You can see they're, they're straight off the machine. That's the nice part. You see the machining on the surface and that makes it unique as well because it's really nice, like on carbon fiber parts, for example, where you see the carbon structure. Here you see the machining, the machining structure of the tools and that gives you a, a unique, really nice look. I'm really glad they haven't polished this. And like you said, you can see all the machining marks. And I like how every single one of these is custom made, so not one, not two of these bikes will ever be the same. That's exactly the point. You can go there and you can say, I want to have it that way, I want to have it that, in that look, and they design it that way, and it lasts forever because aluminum is not rusty, you know? So it's, it's uh, for a lifetime, this bike, and it's your own, it's customer made. Thank you for giving us the insight into how this was made and just how amazing it looks. So thank you from me and all at MTD for your time today and your knowledge on all things Serratizic Tooling. You're welcome. <laughs>